This is Detroit Sports World Talk. My name is Maurice Lewis. It's official. Mr. Quinn has done it again. TJ Lang has committed and is going to sign with the Detroit Lions. And you know what? It was not easy. It was not easy at all. He narrowed, It was a lot of teams going after him. However, he narrowed it down to three teams, Lions, Seahawks, and his formal team, the Packers. So I love it because we literally make that office of line better, especially with Wagner and other new additions to the office of line. And we can protect Matthew Stafford and we now can concentrate on bettering the run game. Just like good teams like um, the Patriots and the Dallas Cowboys, they have good office of line. So they get, they get good running games. And so Mr. Quinn is trying to develop that same tradition, that same culture. And you know what? You have to expect good things to come now. Especially with this signing. Um, I'm pretty positive he did not come cheap. Um, we signed him on a three-year deal. So I'm pretty sure to, in order to get him, the Lions had to pay him a little bit more money than what the Seahawks and what the uh, Packers were trying to offer him. And it just so happens that this is his hometown. You know, he went to Eastern Michigan. He was literally in the NFL. Uh, he's been in the league for a minute. He's 30 years old. And since he's been in the NFL, he's only gotten better in age. He's gotten better while he's gotten older. So nothing but positive things to say about TJ Lang. He was one of the best office of line pass blockers in the game. And the Lions signed him. So it's a great signing because it only makes the team better. It makes Matthew Stafford better. It's going to make the run game better. And be expecting, now that we have um, weapons like this, be expecting in the draft to get better playmakers to work around that and what we've gotten in the free agency. So... Just be expected. I'm excited because, like, obviously, you know, I'm a huge Lions fan. Um, Quinn has been doing really good, important. And, you know, if you if you look at the free agent signings, it's been like we haven't we've we've added like depth. Like we have not gone after any like big name players and paid big time money for them. The only money that we've spent has been more so towards that offensive line, which is very important. So. Um, we haven't spent in free agency. We haven't like you know five million for one year here and there. You know what I mean, like or a three year deal for like ten million. Um, it hasn't been like uh, traditionally. Lions, ha um, they they've literally overpay players to come to Detroit, and obviously you don't see good teams like the Patriots and the Cowboys. Obviously, the Cowboys have spent a lot of money, but. Um, Good traditional teams do not spend money on to bring talent to the table when you can get talent and, and, and it's sought after and it's hidden. And you know what? You bring it to the Lions, you bring it to your team, and you make the team better without having to spend so much money on one player. So I like what Quinn's doing. Um, TJ Lang, great signing. I'm really looking forward to this draft. My next video about the Lions will be probably about the predictions of what Quinn is going to do in picking in the draft. So for, for more information, my name is Maurice Lewis. You can follow me on Twitter, D-E-T Sports World. That's D-E-T Sports World. Thank you. Have a good one.